the one thing I didn't want to talk about was MMA. That's what yeah, we got yeah, yeah. Us. I mean, we got Dean here. We got, <laughs> well, we got, we got, we got, we got, we got Dean. But here. I mean, I know other shit too. You know, what I'm saying? <laughs> we got Dean here. Um, <laughs> How are you just fucking born under a rock with your MMA. <laughs> so, uh, you you guys watch? Uh, I didn't show up late, but <laughs> I showed up. Technically, I'm early. This shit was supposed to be tomorrow, but oh, fact, <laughs> or, or Friday, whatever. Dude. I'm early. You guys, uh, you guys watch the Shannon Sharp podcast? I do oh, with uh, with time. Cat Williams. Yeah, you saw that one. Yeah, I saw that one. I think I I just like Shannon Sharp's pod, Shannon Sharp's podcast in general. Um, I like Gills Arena. Mm -hmm. I like Shannon Sharp. I like Jeff Teague's podcast. Wait, I seen Gilbert Arena. Gilbert Arena is, is does he have one on his own or he has one with a whole bunch of people in there? He has it's his, but he has co hosts. He has uh I forget the light skinned brother's name. He hooped. He's like the moderator. He always got the laptop. He had uh Rashad McCanson. He had he, he Kenya Martin is on there. K Martin. K Martin. K Martin. Shout out to Kenya Martin. Shout out to Kenya Martin. My nigga, you was one of my favorite players. The Nets, y'all should have won twice. They, the league cheated y'all. The referees, they got 4 0. That team. Fuck that. The, the New Jersey Nets, my nigga. That team was strong. Jason Kidd, Richard Jefferson. Yes. Kerry Kittles. Kittles. Kenya Martin. Who's talk the, to him. Who was the last one? Uh, Jason. Oh, you already said Jason <laughs> no, Kidd? No. Jason Kidd, Kerry Kittles, Richard Jefferson. That's pretty much no, all no, the no. black guys. Kenya Martin. And there was one more in the lineup. <laughs> As, was it Keith Van Horn? It was one of them. It was a white boy. Was Keith Van Horn? I think Keith Van Horn started. I ain't going to Either lie, way, pay, shout out to them. I ain't paying attention to the white boys. But yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, shout out to them. I watched it. That's a good, that's a good podcast. Um, it's funny because there's a guy on there, Rashad McCants. And he's he's a very controversial cat. I didn't know much about him. I seen the podcast. And um, he reminded me of Dominic Cruz. In, in, in for the basketball, <laughs> yeah. he's kind of always like always he, he goes against everybody. he goes against Gil. Yeah, yeah. he always goes right, against yeah. Gil. So I remember I was on Gil's page. Shout out Dominic, and Cruz. I commented, I said I beat Rashad McCants one on one right now. That's what I said, and he immediately commented back. I, I got to pull up the thread. I forget where it was, and I'm me and him are going back and forth. Like, and he like, oh, uh, laugh out loud, blah 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 blah. Um, you just. That's just, you just want clout, blah, blah, blah. I said, bro, we could play. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is basketball. Like, I don't know. We can literally go to LA Fitness and play. And he goes, um, oh, I already see you, you, you capping, blah, blah, blah. I said, I'll put some chicken up. You let me know. He's like, 20 bands, 20 bands, or I ain't wasting my time, some shit like that. And I was like, I sent him a DM. I said, yo, say no more. I said, let's do it. And I said, he goes, oh, I see what you're doing. You're just looking for clout. Nigga, you got 90,000 followers and nobody knows who you are. <laughs> I'm, I'm buzzing, nigga. Like, yeah. <laughs> and so I'm like, look, I'll play. I said, bro, I played with former NBA players right now at, at my LA Fitness. Literally, in Windermere right here, there's tons of former NBA players that play there. And Fuck he's like- I'm tall shit, my whole life shit. And look, but here's the thing about basketball. Of course I wasn't in the league. Of course I ain't a, a league ready type nigga. But we could go to the gym and play. Yeah, <laughs> You're not in the league. You was in the league for four years, right? You won in college in 05, whatever. But we could play basketball. He comments. He goes, that's like me saying, um, I could I could beat you up or something. That's no, nothing like that. I said, that's nothing like that. I said, because for me and you to, for me and you to fight, it's going to be crazy. Like, that's something serious. Basketball, we could play basketball like and be cool. Game, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Then I said, how about this? I said, I'll play you one-on-one -on -one for the 20 bands. I said, let's double it up and we could spar after because you brought it up, not me. Yeah. And I said, all you got to do is not quit and you'll get 40 <laughs> bands. He goes, he, I forget, I, I, I forget what he said. Something crazy. I beat the back teeth out of Rashad McCann's mouth, man. He oh, crazy. Damn. But I forget what he I forget what he said. Like he said some shit like, no, no, no. He goes, Oh man, you 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 trolling. You too I looked you up. You 170. You too small for me. Nah, oh, nigga, I walk not. around 200 pounds. I don't care what you are. 
I would wash you. You brought it there. These basketball players, they take it's just a, it's basketball. Right. We could go to the gym and play one on one and have fun and be friends after. But if you want to rumble, nigga, that's on you. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> Not this nigga Phil giving him the Spider Man versus Macho Man fucking I would, challenge. I would, shit, I would. I would. I would. Out of spite. Ready, out of spite. Nigga. Out of spite. Even if, even if I can score, out of spite, I let him beat me. 11 0. Then beat the shit out of him and get all my money back. <laughs> he wouldn't do nothing. Your money back. Beat his ass. Because you know he would quit. I'm, of course he would quit. I put my house on it. Yeah. I, <laughs> I put my whip on it. <laughs> yeah. Immediately. Two leg kicks, he'd quit. He'd right? Like, all right, man, I'm done. I'm done. A single sit him down, he'd yep. quit. You know what I'm saying? It, immediately. Oh, he only six foot four. I thought he was a six he seven. A nigga. Nigga. He a he a brolic nigga right now. Like I could tell he he like, you know what I'm saying? He in the gym. He like he looked unhealthy a little bit, but he kinda I mean look he kind of Let brolic. me Google this nigga. <laughs> Yeah, why, oh. you, why you make him look like that Scully? How many just, followers yeah. you said he had, buddy? Like, ni- like, I don't know, 90 or 95 or some shit like that. Nah, nigga. You can't claim clout when you... He dated a Kardashian. He, he did. only got 90,000. That's what it was, though. That's that's what he was, like, buzzing and for And he dated then. the ugliest one. <laughs> <laughs> he dated Chloe, buddy. That bitch look like Frankenberry, buddy. Nah, nigga. Nah, nigga. I can watch you with some basketball, nigga. If you dated Chloe Kardashian, nigga. <laughs> nah, but like on some on some G shit, I wasn't. I was just like, yo, I'll hoop, I'll hoop with you, man. And he like, they take it disrespectful on some niggas basketball. You don't play in the league no more. Yeah, why they? Yeah, why they take it so serious? Like, I don't. Like, it's, it's, I have it's no idea. It's, it's basketball, bro. Like we can literally play and be cool. We can't fight, especially if you don't fight. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Like yeah. you do not fight at all. I fight six hours a day every day. So like you gonna be very upset while I'm watching you. You know what I'm saying? Like you gonna be mad. <laughs> you want money. Well, hold on, Phil. So can you take him in basketball though? I think I can. I ain't never seen a nigga Look, play. He's he's this is this is a nigga that was in the league for sure, right? right? I'm in shape now. And all we can do is play then. If you that if I said I got the bread, I'll put the money up. Why ain't we playing? I commented, I said I could beat him right now. Da, 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 da. He said, this money, I said, cool, I put it up. Matter of fact, let's go double or nothing, and we'll go MMA. Or or sparring, whatever you want to do. That's why y'all not playing, nigga. Yeah, take away, that last take away that last but, part. <laughs> but, but he brought it up. And I'm talking about it now, so I don't care what you say. He liked the buzz, but he brought it up. He brought up the fight. I was just talking about basketball, having fun. He's but like, you said he liked to go against the grain anyway. He do, he do. He do. Yeah, don't do it, Rashad McCann's. I Listen, I was... I was talking some shit because I don't know you, but I'm talking to you now. I'm telling you, don't do it, my nigga. So what basketball don't player can't fight? What can? Which ones can? Can? None. It's the one nigga. I don't think that, none, too. None. But there's got to be somebody. None. Here's fight. the thing. There's this one gentleman. What's yeah. his name? I'm looking him up right now because I already he know can't fight. He can't fight. He cannot fight. I don't care what karate he did. He cannot fight for real. He could beat up niggas in the NBA, I'm sure. You talking about... Um, Ronald, he's Ronald, just crazy. For me? No, no, no. He's crazy, but like people that could really fight, honestly, man, and this and this hurts me because I'm a hooper, right? I grew up playing basketball. I'm from the Mecca of basketball. And growing up, I always thought I judge people by if they could hoop, right? I'm like, man, he can't fight. He can't hoop. That's how, like that's I was so wrong. Like my <laughs> you whole could, life, you couldn't have been more wrong. My whole yeah. life I was like that though. Like that's how niggas think in the hood. It just is. They be like, man, he can't. He can't fight. He can't hoop. Don't people think like that? Oh yeah, not me, but people do be saying. <laughs> <laughs> but like, and the second I learned to fight, I was like, yo, I was so crazy. Like I was out there. Yeah. Like I'm so vulnerable. Thinking back, how crazy I used to be. Like. Basketball players, not only can they not fight, they're probably the worst They're fighter. goofy. They're mad. Like, at goofy. least NFL players are used to tackling people. <laughs> I'm going to throw three names out there. So, Artest is one. Can't ben, fight. Ben Wallace is another. Ben Wallace is okay. And Draymond Green. Draymond Green it's, cannot right, fight. They can't fight, but it's not going to be a good time is what I'm saying. I think it would so, be. So, what about think, the dude on, I think his name, James Johnson. James, James Johnson, Johnson, yeah. Yeah, he used to, uh, they said he got a, like a kickboxing background. Like he can't know some shit that other than MMA. Because yeah. I couldn't find that motherfucking name. D, my question to you. James Johnson. James Johnson, right? He said he could fight because he'd be doing karate. How many bum ass fighters do you know that train every day? That's what I know. <laughs> that I know, train yeah. every day. I know. That fight fight. Yeah, but this yeah, nigga said his true. whole family was doing the kumite. That got nothing to do with him. Every day. Yeah. Every, Look, you know he mean? got pictures in the gi as a kid. I don't care about none of that shit. As a fighter, 
How many? I know some bum motherfuckers how that many, train every day. That train every day. That ain't no good. Oh, so so so. Well, this is what I'm saying, right? Are we saying can he compete with niggas in the UFC? No, but can but he, he said can he, he beat up John Jones MMA if he gave him six a, months. He, he you he wouldn't beat him. Yeah, in yeah, yeah. six Let's decades. take a second. Let's let's take a second here. Cut the music. Cut everything. Zoom in on me. <laughs> <laughs> What's his name? James Johnson. James Johnson. John Jones could have sex with you if he wanted to. <laughs> <laughs> John Jones could literally have sex with you if he wanted to. To speak on John, the ah, the bah. Don't you, John Jones could literally have sex with you in front of everybody. Shout Don't ever Jones. speak on John Jones. Zoom Crazy out. ass nigga. Zoom out, my nigga. Zoom out. I'm going to tell, <laughs> tell you something. Man. I'm, I'm what you call the, the, the elephant pointer. You know what I mean? That's what I do. That's my job here is to point out the elephant. John Jones is goaded. He done beat up everybody. Everybody got beat up. He lost his last two fights at 205. That nigga ran from Nganu. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's on paper the GOAT. He's been washed for a nice little minute. His his takedowns is not that motherfucking great anymore. He went up against Ganu. Uh Nganu. Oh no, not Nganu. Gan. Cyril Gan. Yeah. So, yeah. He Yo, was fooled. Jamo, open that drawer back. There's a, <laughs> There's a, he there's was a fool. gun in that drawer. John, listen, listen. There's a Glock in that this drawer. This is the thing, right? This is the thing. If you want to be the, you want to be the goat. Jamo, there's a Glock in retire. that drawer. Retire. You want to be the goat? Retire. You want to be the goat? Open retire. the drawer. There's if you're gonna be an active drawer. fighter, pass me that. If you're gonna be pass an active Glock. fighter, you have to fight the pass niggas. Pass me the fucking Glock. And you have to prove it. You have <laughs> I'm to getting prove tight. it. This is my problem. Dean, let this nigga have this it. This is my problem nowadays. <laughs> And MMA, D, let this nigga have it. MMA is a is a is a is is you know UFC is. is can I get in trouble for this legally? UFC is a monopoly, right? They monopolize in that. In order to be, where's this nigga going? With in John? order to be, considered what is he good, talking about? In order what does that have to do with John good, Jones? In order to be considered Dean, let this good, nigga have it. Though. You have to fight in MMA, right? So you have to fight in the UFC. So the UFC can kind of tell you who you're gonna fight. They can dictate it. In boxing, you don't. You can fight whoever the fuck you want to fight, right? Nobody can really tell you nothing. So here's what I'm trying to say. MMA makes you prove it a little more, right? But now people are starting to understand the power that they have as fighters, and they're starting to deny fights. More and more. This time you gotta pay me more. You want me to take that fight? Oh, I don't want that fight. I don't want that. I don't want that. That's cool. John Jones goaded himself during the time where he took all the fights. But what I'm saying is, right now in 2024, that nigga John Jones may not be the best fighter. Fuck in you, MMA. John Jones, <laughs> the best. Dean, let this nigga have it, dog. He may not be Dean, the best fighter. Let no this more. nigga have I mean, it. Bro. No, no, I mean, there, there is some validity to what he's saying. Like, I'm not sure. Like, John Jones, like, Cyril Gunn laid down for John Jones. We know this. But I'm not sure Tom Aspinall would do the same. Talk to him. Talk to him. That motherfucking white hype European nigga might take your goat home with him. All right? Take the title home with him, put him around his waist. He the goat now. Any undefeated? Any undefeated? No, he's, another... got, he's got a loss somewhere. Oh, he got a loss? Yeah. Okay. Here's a here's another truth that people don't want to talk about. All right? Niggas that heavyweight don't be that good. That is true. They don't be that good. Oh. <laughs> you, try, you try to get that gun? <laughs> John Jones is, is, is 135 years old. He went up there and did that to the, the number two. For one, John is from New York. For one. What part? two, no nigga. I don't what care part? where he's, he's from. Like Rochester. I don't care. That nigga ain't from New York. John Jones from New York, for one. For two, ain't no nigga that drink tea in the morning is whooping John Jones. That's that's a fact. Ain't no nigga that's scared of coffee is whooping John Jones. The problem with these MMA niggas. I got to like, see it I, to believe it. Do you believe, do you believe uh, uh, old boy is whooping John Jones? Who? Uh, uh, oh, no, 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 no. What's his nigga's name? Ohio. Steep oh. Well, yeah, Steep Steep Hell no. No way on this no planet. Way. No chance. No chance. No. I don't why you want to see that fight. I don't. <laughs> why John Jones wants Stipe so bad? What's that gonna do for his legacy? He already the GOAT. He don't want it with that white. Where was Tom pure Aspinall? Skin. Where was Tom Aspinall? <laughs> Third Reich. Where was Tom Dream, Aspinall nigga. when that fight was originally booked? Where was who? John versus Stipe. Where was Aspinall then? He was still He was on the ass. couch playing Call of Duty, nigga. He was on he a was. fucking couch. He's the interim Unheard champion. Of. The nigga how win, dare you? If, how if dare Sergei you open your mouth like been, that about the interim champion? How many niggas John Jones beat that were that guy? That, lot, that was unbeatable. A lot. A lot. But how old were they? How old was Aspinall got to show me three niggas on his resume that could, that could match up against 
Leota Machida, when John beat him. TRT Vitor. Glover in his Hold prime. On. Jesus told TRT Give me three Vitor guys. to let go of Give the armbar. Give me three right guys. Here. Tom his, Aspinall. Hey, his, hey, his hit list was pretty strong. What? Yeah. Look, and here's he the thing about John. Hits. They didn't John didn't line they didn't line John up to win. If you listen to the commentary, all you gotta do is listen to the commentary. Yeah, uh, this guy's from uh he's fighting so and so and so oh shit, he just got suplexed on his shit, J.A. Uh, oh my god, <laughs> damn, who the damn, damn. John was never designed to he just was washing motherfuckers. John Jones learned how to strike from you. John Jones got the scariest <laughs> resume when you really look at who he fought and think about his age. 21. He's a child. He's fighting these niggas. I give you all that. But for me, Aspinall, shout when out to him. He was 33. He's he beating he people doing? up. He's, he's, doing, he's doing well. The nigga T T T Santos ain't have no knees no more. Tiago Santos is the only nigga I know. Tiago Santos is the only nigga I know that went to Rikers just to get tattoos. Don't fucking talk about <laughs> Tiago Santos. He went to Rikers to get tattoos. I'm talking about that nigga John Jones. Y'all niggas is crazy. I'm like, yeah, because he lost. He, he lost them last like, two yeah, fights, he lost, fight, bro. he lost them, and God Dean, bless Dean, what fights? No, he didn't fight. lose no, a fight he, to the one nigga. Um, um, to the nigga. The, um, the guy from the, from the bottom. What are you? Nigga, I, I, he the, no. He the greatest. <laughs> 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 and then, the one guy he lost to, uh, the guy who was Matt Hamill? No, nah, yeah. that don't count. <laughs> that don't count. No, he man, lost. No, <laughs> no, man. That don't count. You, you, going, you going to hell. <laughs> that don't count. What y'all talking about? First of all, <laughs> history has told us blind people are more successful Yo, than deaf nigga, people anyway. Imagine what, it, like, <laughs> imagine what it been like for that nigga. He mounted John Jones, elbows. He from the bottom. He, he, what happened? <laughs> What happened? That's fucked up. What happened? <laughs> Nigga, you won. Who, me? Me? <laughs> imagine. You imagine. You imagine, shit. Imagine, <laughs> imagine. Yo. Imagine. Imagine Matt Hamill being woke up. A nigga beating the shit out you. <laughs> you don't know what happened. You can't hear shit. The refs. You won. You won. Me? Me? That nigga like. You won. You won. He couldn't even get off the ground. Yeah? He couldn't even get off the floor. To raise oh, the man. You are going to hell. <laughs> J-Mo, imagine that. You get your ass whooped by John Jones. You in a nightmare, nigga. Your shit going on and off. <laughs> Dean, turn the light on name and off. Dean, turn the light on and off. They say you the whole, this you the whole nigga. podcast. Oh, 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 oh shit. Oh, shit. The ref. <laughs> the ref. You won, me. Oh, shit. You won, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> that shit must have been crazy for that week. <laughs> Yo. Uh, <laughs> Yo. Oh, shit. Paul, oh, think about that that visual. You on the bottom, life, it's going in and out. All you see is John. <laughs> you like in and out. <laughs> Niggas, pick you up, raise your hand. Me? Me? Yeah, nigga, you got it. <laughs> y'all niggas, niggas ain't shit, man. <laughs> Shout out to Ooh. Matt Hamill, though. He don't want to beat John Joe. We just lost all our deaf listeners. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Listen, we don't need him. Statist I'm not for real. Statistically, if you, if you look back through history, Blind niggas are way more successful than deaf niggas. It's just, a, just. Where do you get these stats? Just think about yeah, where, where, where did you find that? How many about? niggas? How many deaf niggas do you know? Like just from off the top of your head. What? You got what? you got fucking Beethoven or some shit, my nigga. But how many blind niggas do you know? You got Stevie Wonder. You got uh, what's his name? Charles. Ray Charles. Ray Charles. <laughs> Ray Charles. <laughs> you got. You got Michael Bisping, the nigga became champion of the world for the same shit. Huh? Huh? Yo, y'all niggas is crazy. 